Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm bringing Coach Apathy back. Ever since Call Champs is done, I really want to help you guys to improve your gameplay. So go ahead and send me some gameplay at coachapathygmail.com. And it doesn't necessarily have to be you winning, but this this whole series is mainly about learning. So you can send me some gameplay of you losing, what, how to improve, stuff like that. But today I will be going over my gameplay in a league match versus Optic Nation about two days ago. So let's get down to business. Let me teach you guys. Let's learn together. Off the break, there's two ways you can push the first hill. There's a green rush, which is a new thing. You know, three people rush green straight through the hill. If you do it correctly, it works. Or you can do the three-man, four-man ice push, which everyone seems to counter it easily. Easily. So right here, I framed the blue window. We're doing the green rush. Uh, sensors just stay waiting up there, trying to do the battery push. But since they have an LMG top blue, kind of stops it. I make sure to get that kill because that's a really important kill. As my team spawns up, I'm just holding the map down. You know, I'm staying alive. Uh, see my team approach. I start pushing up a little bit with my bow. I'm just picking up some kills. Spot a guy cut. Go for the two-piece. Get a nice two-piece to open up the map a little bit for my team. Get three. Now, I'm in this position right here, they're going to be spawning green. As you guys can see, my teammates spawn purple. I have two in the hill that automatically bond blocks pretty much the purple hill. So right here, they're spawning green. I anticipate it. As you guys saw a couple seconds ago, I get a kill. So right here, it's either ice or green. There shouldn't be purple. I come down to help my teammate on the hill. And I'm trying to put some shots. I get a kill, unfortunately I die, but that's fine. Now we gotta rotate. I'll pull up back out to the sub because I never died. Right here I'm rotating through snow. Since my team spawns here, I want to push it up with him. I wait because this guy's pre firing the window. I'll play him pretty easily. Jump back down. Try throw some pre nades, but you know I I kind of messed up on that. See a guy shooting, trying to find him, help my team out, but I guess they got him. I just didn't realize it was fast. So right here now we have top orange control. We have hill control, meaning they are gonna come snow. This is where you just you know preempt snow. You look for the kills. I get one in the back, and I just stay alive. Now I I got a I got a lucky snow spawn. I stun hill, you know, coming to pinch, and I get that kill. Whew. So now I'm pushing out bio. Right there you saw me push bio because I saw my teammate spawn orange. One's in the hill, so that automatically blocks out the back snow spawn. So they're gonna be spawning bio and purple. So I immediately just jumped in and tried to like challenge, you know, and get some kills. And this in hard point, you always want to push cuts really aggressively, especially as a sub player. You always want to be very aggressive, you always want to push cuts, you always want to be in their face. Because you're gonna catch them off guard, you're gonna catch them sprinting, you're gonna be, you know, you're gonna have the advantage on them. So right now they're all rotating from snow. I try to flank them really, you know, try to flank them as best I can, but there was about two, three of them. I should have took it a little bit slower there, but you know, it happens. So now we got to take our time, work together as a team. I stunned the hill. I think he had a trophy, but I stunned him though with the second stun. I tried going, coming in. I get completely lost where they were. I get taken out. My team is, you know, struggling right now. We had the lead pretty, and now they're starting to come back, which is not good. I jump right in the hill. I try to clean up a kill. Unfortunately, you know, three people in the hill shooting at me. I couldn't do it, but we're still trying to get some points in here. I pull out nades to maybe get a nade kill. Freaking trophies. Right here, I just wait out the window, try to get a kill. Pre-fires two down. I jump immediately on the hill, but I have no idea where this man is. I hate this hill sometimes, guys, but it's all great. And that hill specifically, you always want to pinch as a team. You want a guy going back door, you want a guy going front door, you want a guy going window. The whole main thing about the hill is pinching. If you guys can pinch correctly, it's going to get, you know, you're going to win the hill, you're going to break it. And that's how you move on. So right here, I rotate around because you want to rotate. You want to get these spawns. You guys saw I rotated all the way around, even with two seconds left, just because of spawns. Now, I'm in a very good spot to hold spawns. You know, people don't, I get a nice two-piece. Uh, I, I traded the kill with Pat. And I'm getting my teammates spawn. This is really good. You know, you want this green spawn. So now we have three dead. And I'm still playing spawns. You guys see I'm just laying here. But apparently there's a guy outskirts. I immediately go help my team because they're they're pushing them hard. I get a nice kill. But now they got spawns. So I'm just trying to stay alive. I'm trying to be a maniac and, and run around and stay alive. But unfortunately I died. But we're getting some good points on this hill. I spawn bio. And with 20 seconds left, I decide, you know what? It's not worth going all the way around ice. You know, they're... I'm going to get spawns for 15 seconds. It's, it's, it's not worth it. But unfortunately, still we spawn out. Now, we're down by 20 points. But it's not a big deal. I get a nice opening kill of purple. Then I pre-fire this guy. Get the two-piece. That's three dead. Last guy in hill. I push out purple. You know, I stay alive in purple because this is somewhere they might be pushing. But as I see my team die in snow and orange, I immediately rotate. I get one kill, but I die. I get traded. Now, we're only down by 20 points. You know, this is a pretty close game on our host. 
So we gotta step it up. Machilla gets a nice two piece. I'm holding purple, but they're obviously not coming through purple. They're coming through ice and orange. You always calling out spawns on this hill is very crucial. I spot a guy. Yeah, I got that kill. I spot a guy ice, but I wasn't able to get the two piece in time. But calling out spawns is very crucial because a base off where you spawn is where the enemy spawn 90% of the time. So right here, I just jump through snow, try to get some kills. Just jumping around like a maniac, buy some time for my team. You guys can see, I'm not even looking at doors right now. I be patient right here, wait for him to jump back around. I get that kill. That was one kill. Now we caught up. Finally, baby, we're back in this game. You feel me? 101 on 101. Now rotating to the next side. Ooh, I map killer. He probably had a Bauer LMG. Map him with the sub. Stun the guy top blue. You know, buying time for my team. This is being a nuisance. Uh, as a sub player, being a nuisance works a lot. Unfortunately, I couldn't get that kill, but you know, it's all good. Um, I still have two people in the hill. I immediately, you know, just double jump. Boom, boom. Back to hill. I stunned myself. Oh, God. That was the biggest fail. But I still get the kill, and I get traded. So now they got control of this green hill very well. Uh, but, you know, me and Sensor are going to push through ice and hope for the best. I tried, I pre fired that first guy. I tried to shoot that guy, the other guy, which was weak, but he had the drop shot on me. So we're here pushing up, we're pushing together. Uh, you know, they're gonna be green or ice, just like, just like I said, based off spawns, that's what you guys gotta know what to do. Uh, you know, you can't spawns are so crucial in this game because spawns are gonna tell you where they're at. So I, I'll play that first guy, get a nice kill, jump around like a maniac. I couldn't clean up that third guy. But it's all good. We get all four down. We're we're gonna be tied again. Once again, going to the next hill. I stun them all snow. I spot about three of them, and I decide you know I'm gonna go hit. I'm gonna go hit top orange on my team since they're all stun snow. I stay top snow. That's three dead. Now we have a good setup. You see, immediately push into bio because I know they're gonna be bio and snow. The only thing that messed me up there is the fact that I dropped. Uh, I like glitch dropped down, and yeah, it kind of just messed me up because I couldn't really shoot at anyone. But that's how you want to be. See, I'm pushing out, pushing out snow again. I'm pushing out bio. And I die again, but it's just the correct way of playing, especially as a sub player. And you just got to be very aggressive. You got to be very in the face. I almost get spawn killed, which, Jesus Christ. This guy came from top orange. So I immediately pushed top snow, get that guy. And Mirror kills me because I was weak, but it's all good. Two dead. Now... 12 seconds left. This this last hill here, guys, I can't stress it enough. You always want to rotate early. I'm talking about 15 seconds early. I spot this guy. I pre aim before going anywhere because he might peek out. I get the kill. But this hill right here, you know, rotation is key. I'm talking about 15 seconds um, max. Like, you got to rotate around 10 to 15 seconds. You got to start rotating. I raped that first guy. And I'm trying to stay alive outside. I, I managed to stay alive. My teammate trades a kill. At this point, there's about one. There's only one guy in the hill. I'm trying to find him. My teammates get a nice cleanup. I come. Now, this is where I'm trying to find this third guy. Nice. Now, we have full control hill. Three men in hill. I'm raping. I get a three-piece. You know, we're doing such a good job working together. I get a four-piece. You know, we're just doing a great job holding the hill down. And I had to pick up guns. Unfortunately, I had no gun. And but you know we're doing a great job. Me and Doug, I'm holding. Me and him are just getting kills and kills and kills and kills. And we're just doing such a great job of preaming the doors. And they can't really do nothing about it. If our shots on point, if we're preaming these doors, you know it's very hard for them to break it. So I'm I'm on like a seven spree right now. You know just based based off, based off the hill. I get a nice cut through ice because ice is so... They're going to be pushed through ice for the flank. I immediately, after getting off the hill, if you didn't realize, I checked ice. As as since there was a player left on the hill, I didn't need to be the person getting hold the spawns. So I went and straight pushed through ice, and I got the guy trying to rotate. Now here, I literally just got spawn killed. I don't know what the hell guys are doing in bio, but... Now we get spawned. I immediately stun. You know, you want to stun the enemies going inside the hill. Just like that. They're going to be... They're going to come into the hill like, what the hell just happened? I get a nice two piece, help my guy uh, help the people shooting them, shooting my teammates. Now here I throw two stuns, or I throw one. I don't know how many stuns I always throw. It's not, but I get a nice kill. I manage to stay alive. Staying alive is also very crucial in hard point, especially for your team. If you can stay alive and go all four at once, you have a better chance. But let's say you're going one on one and one on one like idiots. It's not gonna work. So I get a nice small behind them. I get the first kill. I manage. I just play to stay alive my teammate still died but you know i go i'm like all right he has to be a little weak i'm just gonna go but there's two of them i get a kill now it's going to the bow rotation like i said guys bow rotation is all about spawns and just playing it as a team 
You know, you gotta make sure you're... I got poor shit at heart as fuck there. But it's all about, just, you know, pushing as a team and also about spawn. So, right here we're spawning purple. That obviously means you're gonna either be snow, orange, or ice. But mainly snow and orange. If you block that snow spawn, if you look snow, you're gonna be orange and ice. And the guy comes to ice exactly like I said. So, but now they're rotating around. So now, look, I spawn orange. That's me. They're gonna be purple and ice. And if they go snow, it's because they took the long way around. But they're usually all going to be purple and ice. So that's how pretty much how it goes. And, you know, we won 214 to 184. I believe me and Mochilla both dropped like a 40 bomb. You know, we played very well together. And, you know, we just we executed together pretty good. You know, we, we did our jobs. But, yeah, that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I'm going to try to improve more on this as I go. I really don't have much to say about, about much of my gameplay. It's more about you guys just looking and learning and I can tell you some tips. But if you guys want to go ahead, like I said, don't forget to send me some of your gameplay where I actually can, you know, give you some positive criticism. You know, some good criticism where I can help you improve your gameplay and actually tell you what you're doing wrong and stuff like that. But in my case, you know, I kind of know how to play the game already. Not being cocky or anything, but I hope you guys liked the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. It's been your boy Apathy, and I'm out.